in the game and wanting fame. There may be a million dollars in the prize pool, but all that money can't buy the prestige and pride of being Premier League poker champion. Last time Annie Duke's Queens met Eddie Sharp's Kings and an exit after hand one. The Brits needed some points, but for Ian Fraser, no love, no luck. When are you playing tomorrow, Ian? Yeah? Fuck no. knows. Don't fucking care either. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off. But Devilfish back into contention with his second place. I ain't got a pair, actually, right? I've got two pairs. <laughs> Bollocks to you all. Oh, no! Man. I said eight feels good. Didn't you hear me? And Roland took nine points to put himself on top of the tree. Big night for Tony G and Andy Black, both in action this evening, and it's likely whichever them finishes ahead will be top of the pops, passing Roland DeWolf, who was first last time out, and model of consistency, Eddie Sharp. In the playoff zone, however, it's starting to look like a big gap between the top six and the others. Devilfish had a nice result, but Vicky Corrin, chance to really pick up some ground this evening and get herself for sure into the top eight. The relegation zone where it's all happening this evening though. Lusk, Helmuth and Helpy, bottom of the pack fighting it out. If one of these three wins, they'll be back in action and for the other two, it is hungry, hungry days. Coming up, Phil Helmuth reached his limit in this Premier League. When you put the great players in a corner, somehow they get out of the corner. When you put the great players' backs against the wall, they come out fighting. But Phil must get by Tony G, and the G-Man has a grudge to settle. It's only one guy that I want to send back home. It's uh, Phil Helmer. Bike time for Phil early, early on today. Get him out of the way and basically shut him out of the Premier League. This is league match number eight coming to the table and uh, good action. I'm here with I tried fan favorite and first. I tried king down. of the Last British poker the players, the devil fish. Dave, the the you've got nine stuff. points now. There's nine a, a couple results you're looking you for. I guess you're looking for the bottom to, to stay <laughs> there, well, especially uh, guys like Phil Helmuth. Chips on the table, yellow's worth a thousand, blues are two, red's 5k apiece. Of course, every player has 100,000 which brings 600k on the table. Joining me in the box, Dave Devilfish Elliott. You've been playing these first levels pretty fast, and I think you've picked up about 25 or 30,000 every match in the first level. Has Helmuth and Healthy, have they been playing too tight, you think, early on? Yeah, you know, they're sitting on the open they held up um, too. There's some big confrontation early on, and they get points straight away without doing anything, you know? I don't, have to, I don't like to rely on other people uh, getting knocked out. I like to try and knock them out, you know? <laughs> this is Tony G, first hand, under the gun, ace four, 6,000. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, I'd like say it can get a little bit reckless. Good luck, Andy. Good luck, Marcel. And, uh, Phil's shaking everybody's hand, but uh, there's a pot in action. It's 4,000 on Marcel. Do you think Helpy's come in here with a different game plan? Uh, he usually plays very tight first level. Yeah, he's got Jack Nine of Arts and he's, he's got positions. And it's not a bad call. Well, if Tony fires out here, uh, I didn't like it. It's no good checking now. I think if he's going to raise, he's going to have to bet it. Yeah, I mean, because, you know, what's the point of raising? You're not going to catch up with his fall. You might as well not bother raising if you're not going to follow through. Good luck, Fishy. <laughs> Phil's talking to you. To <laughs> I heard that quote from somebody. That's what Devilfish said, the SAS motto. Who dares wins, and you has motto, who cares who wins. No, I heard somebody said, I don't care anymore today. Raise it up a little bit, gentlemen nice. and ladies. A little six total. ball. Nice. I'll tell you what, uh, oh, <laughs> Phil does not need a bad start. No. Raise? He'll just throw this essay away so quick. Pass. He might do a little speech first of all, but he'll throw it away. Oh, look at Vicky with his queen in. Wow. Well, I'd like to see. Uh, obviously, I need Vicky and Vicky to get involved here because uh, she's close to me on the lead on the on the board too. 
I think Vicky might throw this ace queen away. Yeah, yes. and Phil will throw his away. We be. I know, Fishy. This has been a big hand this week. Her eights. People keep moving in with this hand and no removing way. in and keep talking to herself. Her eights, her gun gets. Well, Andy's starting off well, but I, I mean, you nothing, like man. you like to fold by Vicky. I, I mean, know it, she, I know she she's she just does not like to get involved well, early. She she's looking to pick up two, three Before points every time. And she, uh, <laughs> well, it's an automatic well, fold, ace queen. One has been a raise and a re-raise anyway. You know, I mean, yeah. uh, it's just automatic. Well, you knew I had a hand. Or wait. Pass. Should have known I had a hand. Pass. Pass. I'm not sure if I'm going to have a hand today. I think Tony's going to be raising a lot of buttons tonight. So he's doing this again when he says four. <laughs> All right. I'm going to play with you, Tony J. Cool. Well, look at this. Phil I'm going to check to you, okay? King eight, eh? Check. Check a Rama. Check a Ruski. Phil knows he has, to, he has to play some pots with Tony G, right? I mean, you have to. To give him a chance. Yeah, well, Tony's going to win this one now, I would imagine, check. unless Phil doesn't move, but I don't think he will. Check. I'm gonna so he's check. checked it again, you know I mean? Wow. You can't catch up with this four. Yeah. <laughs> six? Check six. Well. You know, Dave, uh, I mean, it wasn't in Tony G's best yes. interests uh, for you to have a huge night last time, but he was in here in the commentary. He, he was rooting for you. He was no. shouting to the TV. He rooting you like on. Oh, I think he just, he just he likes, likes it. No, ace ace. Any good? Pressure ace is on ace Phil ace Helmuth, but he's, he's up for the mental challenge. Right. I feel very strong. I feel very, very, very strong. I think that uh, I think that today I was hanging out, hanging out with Andy Black, and we were talking about meditations, and I kind of remembered who I was. When I'm at home for seven weeks with my wife and kids, it's good to kind of to, to kind of you know lower yourself a little bit and relax, keep your guard down, and and hang out. That's very healthy. But now it's time for me to rise to my full power. You know, and, and you know, today I remembered how much power I have. So I'll bust somebody and I'll bust somebody else. But the third time I get them, I won't show. Don't bust yourself with aces too. That would be very unfortunate. What well, made you believe you're gonna get aces? Pass. Raise, Raise again. Raise, Raise them all, fish. Well fuck a lot of raggy aces out in this uh Jeez. And Andy Black's got a handy. Cool. I don't like this call, you know, I should raise it. Right. If it comes Pass. any over cards, Phil can take it away from him with him. I don't like the call. I should be raising. And especially a chance to re-raise Helmuth for the second time in a row. Oh, yeah, that, you know, it's got a double-sided because it'll get Helmuth hot. And also, um, you know, you don't have to see a flop. I mean, what do you want to see? Hey, look, <laughs> what's he going to do now? Wow. Checking. Look at this. Check. Wow. Of course he's checking. Check. Unbelievable, eh? That's a, a nine ball comes off here. There's gonna oh, look at this cold deck. Unbelievable. Oh so this Helmer. is this could be the end of Helmer in the Premier could, League. If he'd have raised there, if, if Andy had raised there, it would have been the end of him. I'll tell you that now. Helmer would have more stacked off. Well, Helmer's gonna bet again, and and Andy's gonna raise. I mean, there's no way that Helmer could feel like he's beat here, right? No. I mean, if he's just wondering how much he can get at the moment. The only Andy's scared of is two nines. I see. I can't believe he's checked it. How, wow. how has he checked it? I don't know. 14,000. If Elmer raises, he was out the tournament. If he raises, I can't see how he can call. This has to be a check raise, right? Yeah, yeah really, it has to be. I mean, he's, he's playing so t he's playing too tight to win this. I think if he, to win this tournament, if he uh, if he just calls, yeah, I mean, wow. There is absolutely no way he can think Andy Black has a big... I mean, even if he reads him strong, right? He's got a, he's got a raise. Yeah, right. there comes a raise. Now, Andy's going to move in on him, probably. And, I mean, Andy's only scared of two aces. He's got to, he's got to move in on him. 26. 26,000 more. Gee, this is like... Uh, this is a Christmas here for Andy Black. I can't believe Rolling. it. Yeah, Rolling. that's the move. Now, he's, now Phil's sick now. Now Phil's going to tell him he's got two nines, because Phil knows he's got two nines now. Oh, it's a total bluff. He knows he's got two nines. Oh, my. Look at Phil's face. Wow. got to feel sorry for Phil. I mean, what a... Fishy, fishy, fishy. Who knew I'd make a full house this early in the game, buddy? I don't know, buddy, but you're in bad shape. bye-bye, Phil. You're I don't right. know how I could lay this down. <laughs> 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 I can't believe it. <laughs> I'm trying to lay this down, but I can't do it. How much does he have? 
<laughs> Did he turn nines full on me? Yeah, that's the one, buddy. I know wow. you. That's the only hand you're scared of. He's it's laughing about it. He can laugh about it. Well, he's laugh. laughing because he can't believe it. You know, he's you know, he's wow. flopped a full house. And you know, this only happens on TV. You know, it's this amazing is this sick. stuff, huh? Wow, this is sick. Oh, this is what it's going to take to get me out of the Premier League. Hands like this one, I guess. I, I can't lay this down. Six is full is good. Nines, buddy. Wow. There was no five. way out. No, there was nothing, absolutely no way there. out. Seven eight, I made a straight in the end. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Seven. <laughs> really? <laughs> so straight in the end. Yeah, of course. Oh, unbelievable. Yes. Made a straight in the end. Is he out? I don't know what the chip situation was, but I think... Fish. I think he's out. Oh, my gosh. What the fuck? I feel bad for you, Phil. That's, That's disgusting. I flapped a full house, and I'm out. That's so right. sick. That's unbelievable. The rest of these players are all in with fours and fives and sevens and eights and nines. I flopped a full house, and I'm out. Yeah. So sick. That was, well, very, that was very unlucky. Cold act. Now what the fucking hell is that? Gotta That's got to be the biggest cooler of this scenario. That is that is the hard side of poker. Yeah. He's now only got four points, really uh, five points. Cool excuse me, through four right. matches. I want I want the limo. I'm ready to go. I don't want to hang out. Oh my. Well, I can only say that's good for me on the point situation. <laughs> Poor old Phil. <laughs> I mean, I I wonder if he can come back for that. He's got two more chances. He's gonna have to win. He's gonna have to win a heat. Look at that. He checked the flop there, Phil Helmuth. But I mean, Devil, you, you check the flop for the full house, don't you? I mean, you have to go. You well, have you know, to go the only, you flop. know, the only trouble, the only, you know, you can check the flop, of course, because you flop the full house. You flop just, you know, the absolute nuts barring two aces, you know. But then again, if you bet out and hope the guy's got an ace, you get a lot of action. Right. And right. if you haven't got an ace, he's obviously probably got a pair, and then you're only going to get action if he hits the pair. So right. there is a, there is a, uh, you know, there is some reason for betting out, but you know, what I mean, it's tough. I don't know. He's unlucky. It's not a hand that uh, very many people in the world get away from. None, nobody in the Premier League could have folded it. So it's okay. I still have two more heats. I'm uh, I'm frustrated, but uh, I'm not frustrated that I made the call. I mean, maybe I could have made some spectacular laydown, but I, I don't think so. They're all playing so bad, and I get in with a full house, and I can't win. Back for more from the Premier League after the break. With two black nines, one Phil Helm with the world title and a million dollars. But that was 20 years ago. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Actually, he cracked my aces with the same two nines. You remember in the last uh, Premier yeah. League? Yeah. So I guess they've done him a, quite a lot of good. That was. Well, that's good for me. I just need Tony G to get busy now. Come on, Tony, re race, son. Uh, Tony likes to, you know, they're all calling with these. Uh, come on, Vicky, baby, do a move over the top of them. Is she capable? She'd win it if she did, I know that. No, she's just oh. going to see a flop. They're giving Lusk a free shot at this, aren't they? Well, yeah, he's, he's got a free shot of nothing, really. I mean, yeah. what's he going to catch? A nine? I, I mean, actually, Vicky's favourite to catch someone on the flop here without King Queen of Diamonds. There you go. Look, the old fish is like psychic stuff, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, actually, right. Marcel's caught his nine as well. <laughs> and the best dance caught nothing. <laughs> Welcome to Northern Middle. If you're Vicky, you, Vicky's, Vicky will bet and win this, I guess. I don't think Tony's going to take her on with that nine. 17,000. They're just going to muck, muck it. Would it have been smarter for her to check it, or would, would, would Marcella just check behind anyway? She, I mean, she don't want to check it with a straight draw and a flush draw. Though, right. You know, I mean, and if she checks it and somebody bets, now she's got to put a lot of chips in and come over the top to see where she is. Right. So this is, I would bet it too. It's a good bet. And now Marcel's problem, uh, obviously, he's only got six points. He really can't he, afford to be gonna, dumping he's chips. He's going to throw this nine away. I mean, right. he knows she's betting with someone better than a nine. I can't believe he's, he's interested, really. Yeah, it's gone, and Tony's gone, and she wins it. That's it, Bob. Nice bet. Of course, you have the best hand. 
Had the best hand. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> that before the flop. We made it the best hand for the flop. I had ice jack. I should have re I had ice jack of spades. You see, you, you would walk into her, she got ice king. Nah. Have ice king? Queen king. I can't give this kind of information, but I think you know that I wouldn't have put a thousand in if I didn't like my hand. Queen king. Tony said exactly he right there. He should have raised and took the hand down with his ace jack. jack. He, he played it back. No, he said sixes are good, so he has to have ace five. Yeah, yeah, ace five is well yeah. He flashed an ace anyway. Oh, he did? Well, then he has to have ace five. Pass. That would have been a big call if it called with ace queen. Pass. Pass. But he almost might as well call it. Six pass in total, because it turns he doesn't have a bigger four. Okay. Let's call one. Pass. He raises black from the button and uh, oh, Lusk, he doesn't mind taking off flops. Let's see how uh, the cards help me out. Good shape here, dude. Yeah. Check. 6,000. 6,000. Dangerous sort of player, the Dutchman. If he raises here, is Andy done with it? Yeah. He's just decided to Let slow play. It. Well, the way Andy's going, probably nine or an eight will come off here. Even a hat will be dangerous for my son. Hey, yellow, I told you. Wow. <laughs> it's scary stuff, huh? All right, we're going to Vegas, Devilfish. I want to go to the roulette wheel. Would you call every number? <laughs> I know Marcel's going to get busy because it's that dangerous out there. No, he's just called again. I don't know. I mean, to me, he's either got a raise or throw it in the dust. <laughs> It's a, it's a, it's a Chinese. I have to play him like this because you have been in the monastery and learning all these things. So we really. never went. <laughs> no, that's advanced training. That's a, that's bad news for Marcel. This is defensive, isn't it? Yeah, he's going to get that's called it. Cool. Two pair. You have two pair. Yeah. I had ten seven. I yeah, Marcel seven. needed a hat to come I off or a club or a seven or something, you know, and then it would check, check. Obviously, you King would have been better. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't raise me on the flop. You didn't raise me pre-flop. You lost the minimum. <laughs> I'm not going to raise you. I have a big hand. I hit it. I want to get the maximum out of it. You get lucky. You hit the three out. Of it. I know I got you like this. The four doesn't make a difference. I'm going after all of them. Each one of them. And I, I don't take prisoners. I want to clean them out, get done with them, because I want to win this heat. And I'm desperate to win this heat because it look, I feel like I'm silly. Sitting there knowing exactly what's going on, who's doing what, I'm looking forward to create a possibility to get in the top four still. And the only way to do that is to win it straight out. He might be dead if he doesn't win. Pass. It's going to be marginal, but if you're one point behind the dead, it's, 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 cool. it's the end. You see, I like this call. Now, this is a good call in on 10 Pass. Jack of Diamonds. You know, you've got a lot of cards to catch here, a lot not, a lot of nice flops you can hit. I mean, I'd sooner be in there with this than ace, four, ace, five. Yeah, and, right. and look at this, you are with 780 diamonds. Queen's two. Yeah, two in a row. You can still do it. Uh, two games like we needed yeah. a couple of diamonds out there. Two, two hits in it's a row. Like two hands and poker, you know? Two Check. Games. Jack. For him, it Check. won't be enough to, to get, make the playoffs. If he wins two in a row, just at the top Check. eight. I think Marcel's going to take this. Oh, no, you are going to take it. Marcel should have took it last time. 6,000. Call. Pass. Because now it's me. That's a, that's a funny call. I mean, Dave, he, he must be planning on bluffing the river. Yeah, I mean, I'd have sooner have bet it on the flop. Three, you see. No, no. It, Free's, a, free's a, a, a card that you are can bluff at now. It's more, more likely the blind's got a free than Marcel, so I know the boss being taken away from him. 9,000. And now he's got to throw it away, Marcel. Wow. Yeah. Free was a, a bad card for Marcel to do any move. You are doesn't get many bluffs through on the river, but he got that one through. Yeah, free was the perfect bluff card. He'll look as the most no, no, dangerous can, players oh, in the Premier up, League. You have probably as a, as a you and Phil and uh, Roland, maybe. Uh. Well, you know, I mean, it, it, he's got to dodge Andy Black here, actually, because he's the only one at the moment who can knock him out. Can might take him a little bit longer. If Tony's playing passive like he is. I'm sure we got something in mind for him. Thank you. Cool. That's a terrible call. Cool. She could afford to raise there about 6,000, you think? Yeah. Cool. Cool. You let them all come in together. 
Okay, guys, here you go. <coughs> Give it a shot. Let me hit my full house. Four fifths of the field in. Turned into a, a well, Andy Black's got a straight flush draw here, and he's got a pair. He'll like this flop. On the deep mind, I'm looking for the twos. There's five. And, uh, and Vic, and Vicky will definitely like it. I don't know what Marcel's doing in there with his clean flush draw. I mean, he could be stone dead. Yeah. Vicky's gonna. What's she gonna do here? She should be thinking about raising. Raised. Yeah. Eight thousand more. Eight thousand more is neither in or there, really. Not, not that's gonna do. Pass. Must be a great swap for you, yeah. Cool. But Marcel's. Wow. Uh, this is a really loose call, isn't it? I mean, does he know that nobody has the king? I don't know. It's a strange call. Yeah. That was Andy's card. That was Andy. I, I thought Andy would like the flop, you know. I thought he'd have been in there. I mean, he's got a yeah. straight flush draw, straight draw. You can't really be worrying about people having flushes at all of them, so he should have, you know. Check. Anyway, he got rid of it. You know, uh... The wishing you never know. Right. Uh, well, I think Master. I mean, he, he's got to give her the pot or, uh, or throw a bluff Check. in here. I don't think he's going to bluff it. He has to put all his chips into bluff it, and I don't think he wants to put all his chips in on a bluff. Especially as he's just called and checked the tent. It looks like he's got the dry king of okay. crazy in his hand. That's what it Check. looks like. Right. Well, that's good. Obviously, we know he's got the queen. I think Vicky would have called him there the way the, way the answer I'm sure you didn't have the king of spades there. Well, I thought you might have the king of spades. So. Of course. Yeah, that was the obvious character. I might have it, but... It's a good part for Vicky Corrin. And, uh, then again. you know, she'd probably be pretty happy to crack the top three here and, and see what, what goes from there. Really, yeah. Really Obviously, there's an extent to which I'm the underdog in this lineup. I was last time. I am again this time. Sometimes I think I'm here because, you know, <laughs> the British need an underdog to root for. Nobody loves these guys more because they go on about how brilliant they are. And I know a lot of it is to do with being brave. I'm just thinking, they don't scare me. I'm as smart as they are. Stick my chips in. But actually, looking at how some of them play, I think it's less about being brave and more about just, just being a bit calculating. I'm not going to pass. Not on the river? Of course not. No. I'm you can't beat anything. That's not true. Raises. That's not true. Okay. I checked the turn because if Marcel's beating me, he would call a bet, and if he's not, he might bet the river, so I might as well call pass. that. That's the only way to get chips if I'm winning, pass. just to check and call on the end. She only would pass. lose chips if I hit the flush. I can't pass. I can't Holy. pass. It's only the second, or excuse me, it's the, it's the first level and Lusk all in, in one in 2000. Well, not yet. And quick call from, oh, oh my gosh. It's, it's I know you can't do it. Tony G does this every time, he gets down to about, you know. I've got to avoid a seven. He gets down to about half his stack no, he and, he, and he, he finds a... I have to avoid uh -huh. Wow. <laughs> still, a, still a big raise by Marcel, but I guess he figured if he got re-raised, he was going to have to call anyway. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's not wrong, it's not wrong. Right, right. Yeah. right. Oh, I don't know how many chips did Marcel have at this point. 36,000. I feel like I have to avoid a seven. Let me take some monkey luck here, so from the monk. I had the other pair of sevens. <laughs> no, <I'm joking. laughs> Nobody had a seven. <laughs> <laughs> only the about 50, 50, I only want to see red cards. All the queens are out. Oh, I had no seven favorite. and no queen. That put me in favor if I only see red cards. Marcel well, could really use a seven. Eight Double belly buster eight the hard of way. Eight or a four of clubs. They don't want the eight of clubs. He's got the queen of clubs over there. Yeah, a five would be all right. Yeah. He got six now. But he's got the nine ball now. I improved. Can make a straight. He can make a set. That's it. Yeah. No. Sorry, Marcel. Okay, guys. And Bevelfish, yeah. only one point for Marcel Lusk here. He's going to be on well. seven. There's uh. I don't know, nothing went right for Marcel. Ace King went down, the sevens went down. You're still all right. Flesh draw went down. He's two players gone in the first Marcel level. Is in good position. Because seven points is I'm not, very good not position. so bad. I didn't get it. You just have to win one, one, one Probably one turning out pretty good for your fortunes so anyway. Yeah, yeah I mean, it's good for me. One. I mean, you know, Marcel's a good focal player and he didn't, I don't think he played Marcel's his best there. Really well Only a win, win second or win win can help me to get in the. The last eight, I think, uh, I still need 15 points, 18 points or something. So I need to win something. Otherwise, you look stupid. You feel stupid. 
Do I lose to it? So Devil just four-handed after uh, 18 hands. Uh, I mean, you know, does Yuha Healthy have a chance to, to come back and take nine points here? I hope not. Um, I, I've got to hope that Andy Black and Sony G do the business. You know, I mean, Sony's just doubled up now, so he's got I think he's 113,000, and Andy Black's on 200 and something. So they're both strong players and both got a lot of chips. And but the buff, you got to remember, the buff got a big cushion. You know, they don't need to, and there's not a lot of pressure. on them. Interesting oh. call from Vicky Korn, and uh, Yuha's in on the button. Everybody's got a hand they could have raised with if they wanted to. Yeah. To well, that, and the other two sixes have oh. raised. I like this raise. No, I think, I don't know what Vicky's going to do here. It's King Jack of Diamonds ain't much of a hand. Uh, I mean, she don't know if he's not going to call. Yeah, she's coming. I think she's raising. No, no she's, she's just calling. Call. Well, if you could see the hands, the call would be great. But she can't see the hands, so it's not such a great call. But let's see what happens. Andy's got a huge chip stack, but uh, Vicky's in position here. Yeah, there's, well, there's a lot of flops can come down Andy won't like. Just about any. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Could have been the Jack Six out there. There'd have been a bit of action. Yeah. 16,000. Well, Vicky's done it again. She's running good. I mean, David, if, if she raises here, she can really only get called by hand that beats her, right? Do you think there's a better chance she should she should call or? No, I think she should see where she is now. She should. I mean, he's the raiser. She should raise now and see where she is. I think. Looks like a raise for sure. It might all be right. a minimum raise. Oh, he's gone all in, Andy. Wow. Wow. This is a strong play. And this uh, this is the problem with Andy Black, yes. right? He he's capable of uh, of making Where's these kind of plays, isn't he? He looks nervous as well. Look at him. Wow. She's not even looking at him, but it does look like uh, they don't like it. Dave, should she have uh, considered this? Uh, or, I mean, it, it looks like, from her point of view, if everything's correct, that she's beat. Well, I mean, uh, this is what happens when you call with a King Jack, you know? I mean, it's tough to catch someone that you really like. Okay. And if you're planning on a strong player like Andy. Well, it was a good move. I mean, it, was, it, picked, strong. It, it picked his player there, you know, it yeah. picked Vicky, and he knows Vicky's, she's low on the points, she's struggling. It, you know, it, I, I'm hoping he did that. I mean, uh, it didn't seem to take much time thinking about anything. If you get a bit overconfident, um, you can be out of the middle. You know, somehow I'm just trying to be present and uh, seize my opportunities. Yeah. See how I believe you, and you, you, you don't believe it's so, so <laughs> sad. Right? It's so sad. I'm not showing anymore. Oh, what's the so you don't want me to call him, It's very hard to I call. I don't want you to call. call. He's on autopilot, Andy yeah. Black. Of course. I'm not going to move it. Well, Queen Santa Clubs is in a bad little answer. Yeah, so back. Back. Nope. Same guy, every time. He's got the button. Now Tony's gone out of the way. And I mean, uh, Vicky and uh, Tony be glad to see these two play a big part. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, I don't know why, why Elp is calling with King Seven of Diamonds, really. Oh, look at this flop here. Look, Kings and Sevens and the Nut Flush Draw. Wow, and the a straight royal, draw. The Royal Flush Draw. Excuse me. We're going to get some action here, I'll tell you now. Andy's going to do a ra Andy's going to raise you. All in. All in. What do you have now? I mean, Elp, he, can't, he cannot fold. There is no way Black would do this with Aces and Kings, would he? Can he wow. fold? I don't think so. It's only the only way it could fall is because of the guess. point. Yeah, he's put him on the flush draw. That's what I told you. When there's a flush there's draw, there's no there. way I'm laying this down. But I know there's no way I'm winning this anyway. <laughs> he doesn't feel lucky, does he? This could be his Premier League. He well, knows exactly yeah. what Andy has, yeah, doesn't yeah, he? Yeah. Well, that's all he can have to move in with. That's what I said to you. Don't move in when there's a flush draw. When there's two clubs there. I just said this earlier, man. But when he's the jack of the club here. In the Premier League, change your fortunes around. He said, I know I'm winning, but I know there's You're no right way I'm right? going to win. He doesn't feel it, well, Dave. I wouldn't worry too much. Well, you know, this is what you get yourself in when you call with a king seven of diamonds. There it is, boom, Let's club. See. No danger. No danger. 
No. Well, that's good Running for me. Running good, Andy. As long as the King of oh, yeah. Seven don't come off, that's good for me. Wow. Well, this has gone perfect for me so far. Oh, that was close. Well, you are. Wow. Wow, what a cool. Like, what a cool. Like it's running good. Wow. And just to rub it in, Tony cool. says, champ, good. good luck, champ. What have you done? What deal have you done with the devil? Well, that's perfect <laughs> for me. Yuha's going to get two points only, Devilfish. I mean, 36 hands. And this is Andy Black's done it again. This is the way he won, uh, won his first one. He had three quarters of the chips after 25 hands. He's, he's destroyed them. Yeah, I feel like I'm out already. That was like mentally too tough to take. So I feel like I'm out of the Quite a lot at stake here. If Ed, uh, Andy Black and Tony G finish in the top two spots, they're like guaranteed, or it'll be very difficult for them not Hola. to be in the in the top four. Vicky's got nothing. She pushed all her chips in here. She's gonna take it. She just took it. How much is that? Yeah, how much is it? What's Tony got? Well, I, I think now that he showed his cards, that they're dead actually. Forty-one thousand. I think. I'm not sure. It's 35. I know he's only showed him to Vicky, but I think the rules are that his hand might be dead. He's showing a nine anyway, so yeah, he's probably not cool. in good shape. You're winning. Oh. Uh, that's what I figured. Let it go here. Well. Well, Vicky finally oh, had a rush of blood. And now Tony, that nine king, he loves that nine he king. He does. That's, that's his hand, nine king. But will I win? I don't know. That's a that strong move. Have no control over. <laughs> well, this is great for me if Tony can butcher. win. But uh, I don't know. I don't know. How he manages to call with a nine king. Being butcher, come on. <laughs> yeah, Butchers. Vicky's in trouble. Yeah. There's the butcher. The, the king's there. Look at that flop for him. Queen to make it interesting. A queen would make it interesting. Wow, look at that flop. Not that interesting. Make it interesting. Yeah. <laughs> Not very interesting for Andy to see anything. Well, there's uh -huh. some hope. Oh. And now needs to be an ace. <laughs> well, she called the queen oh, and it really came over. This yeah. only, it's only happens on television, huh? Just to She's call the cats. Yeah. Oh, nearly. All right, Thanks. good luck. It's a good Nearly's performance fine. from I'll Vicky Corn. Three points. Yeah. She's well in this. Oh, I'm fine. <laughs> Phil Helmuth never calls for that. You know. Well done. We made it through. <laughs> My last game just did my head in. There was sort of, everyone was sort of surviving, surviving. Kravchenko was passing ace 10 when the average stack was seven big blinds. I mean, it was soul destroying. At least this time people were playing. I was playing. I should probably have played a bit less, actually, and uh, survived longer, but it was much more fun, much more kind of rough and tumble. Yeah, Martin, it's any it's gotten to very, steal. very quick down to the <laughs> heads-up stage. Andy eight, Black won eight, one of eight, his eight. matches in 63 hands. They've only played 50, I and he's eight, got 470 eight, plus thousand yeah. devilfish. And uh, up against Tony G, is this one written in stone, or uh, has Tony Thank got some kind of play here? Yeah, Tony's not bothered now. He's, I guarantee you Tony's going to be all in, in okay, the first three hands. Hold on up to now. <laughs> first three hands. He's not bothered now. He's well got second place. He's happy. It's not like Tony G to play this game, which is to sit back and let everybody else knock themselves out. But um, that's pretty much what he's done today, and Andy's taken care of business. Yeah, he's done it smart. He's done the smart way, Tony, which is unusual. And um, the only real reason that Tony wants to win this, and Andy wants to win it, is it'll put them on three wins. And they're in danger then of either getting level or beating Phil Elmer's four wins. And they've been talking about that, so another one to do it, just so they can needle Phil, probably. I mean, that's, that's worth everything. There's no amount of money that can uh, be like trying to beat or tie a helmless record here. Apparently, there's a book out called Kill Phil. Have you heard about that? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, I went up We're to skipping the glide dance. levels and everything. <laughs> we should. Um, they should well, have asked look. you to write a chapter or two, Dave. Yeah. <laughs> I call. call. Well, Tony's just calling. If this would have been a King Nan, he would have been in there like a shot. Okay. Oh, Friends. okay, Andy. Look at this. Wow. Nice. He's changed. They're all of a sudden, they're both playing quiet now. I mean, the blinds are only three and 6,000, but Black has been kind of go get them. Yeah, well, that's a pretty good okay. flop for uh, Black. All in, watch you, Landy. All in. Oh, no. 10, just call. Okay. Call. Huh. He usually goes all in with a flush draw. It's the first one he hasn't. Yeah. Oh, 
that way. Oh, look at that. <laughs> he has hit everything. Well, I don't see how Tony can bet again here. He can't beat anything. <laughs> I know. But Once Andy called him on the flop, he'd give it up. Oh, look at that. Oh, just in case. Oops. Don't forget about it. You can't get a shill in here. What's he doing? Cool. He's, called, He's him. called him with the king. Is he on That's drugs? That's a nice hand. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> well, well, Tony feels stupid now. <laughs> Devilfish was he uh, was he was he putting Andy oh, on some kind of straight cool. drill there? You know, the only hand he could beat was Queen yeah. Ten. I mean, I, that's the only hand. Sometimes if that's, there's only one hand you can beat, you talk yourself into believing they might have it. Won't well, last long. It I was guess, it? Yeah. I guess he called wow. him there just so he looked good. You I know mean, what a great call. It's hard to have that. Although a double managed to double down, uh, successfully heads up. He's done a lot of things wrong. It's unbelievable how I'm playing. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Might limp in Cole. here? Cole. Yeah. yeah, he's calling open Tony gets busy. I'm all in. Cole. Oh, you all sucker, right. Tony. <laughs> you nice. sucker. This has, been, a, this has been a browbeat, uh, Devil Fish. Well, Andy, you know, Andy's caught the deck and he's played it aggressive and he's. You know, he's. he's, he's well done. He's played his hands well. Ah. Tony's probably going to catch the AC, though. He's been running pretty good too, this tournament. There it is, look. That's nice. No danger. Race oh. from space. Do you, uh, get a club? Do you think uh, Tony could, uh, get a club? Could make a, club, a little run here? Yeah, well, Tony's running. You know, Tony, Tony's running good and Andy's running good, so who knows what can happen. Will it be a queen? I don't think so. No. no it's a club. How much? Nice hand. Thanks, sir. Sorry about that. I didn't expect to win. Hand can't hold up forever. I can't imagine Tony <laughs> ever expects to win. Can you the way he plays? 62 more, right? 60. Look at this ace king two now. This is all in this. It's an all in situation. Well, it's just, cool. just a cool. No, no, it's an all in situation. Yeah. Ah, that's nice. I mean, there's just no avoiding well, it either way, is there? No. Well, <laughs> heads up. I mean, unbelievable. I just want to see Ace Nine or something. Better stand up. Standing up is working better for me. If uh, if you Tony G wins this, <sighs> they can favor nine nearly. Nine. I'll take the nine to five if he wins. It. <laughs> ace from <laughs> space. You'll no, he's shouting for the ace from space. You don't want the king no. for some reason. I think he'll win. No, you see. You got Oh, look at the clubs. clubs. <laughs> you got clubs. everything. Wow. It might still be fair. This is an even money miss. chance. It's even money, yeah? Can't miss. <laughs> it's amazing the kills at the, the deal out on this, this table. Slight edge for black according to the odds. Wow. Oh, no. no Tony's favorite. Come on, put it up there. Don't make me count. <laughs> Nine up with a Still yeah. alive. Oh, yeah, yeah. I feel like playing longer. It's pretty tough <laughs> to outdraw. I can play a little bit longer. It's pretty tough to draw, outdraw Tony G these days, I'll tell you that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, uh, he's running very good. I almost know I'm lucky. Yeah, this, I know he, he's still uh, trailing, but Tony's going to feel like he's got a fortune here. Now we got a game. Avoid a few cards. Whoever does win this between Andy Black and Tony G is going to be a massive favorite to win the, the league table at the end of this season. Yeah. And uh, there's a lot of uh, prestige in that. Of course, it was Phil I Helmuth last year. Rise 20,000 more. Yeah, but you can't eat prestige. All right, that's because yeah. I want to see what you do after the flop. No. <laughs> uh, I might get lucky. I think the raise came from Andy Black. In the small blind, big blind, excuse me. Well, I'm all in. all in. Oh my gosh. Well, he's got a middle pin straight draw. <laughs> That's enough for him. <laughs> I think Tony yep. thought it was not, not a good idea. Gonna have the heart and commitment to call alone. Well, know. that was that went really quick. I mean, Tony's yeah, got yeah, most yeah, of the reds yeah, now, flopped. Dave. I, I flopped it. I hit my flop. I think I couldn't hit much more than what I hit. The chip really? leader. <laughs> he's running over Andy now. Yeah, well. It's, it feels like he's on a free roll, you know. I mean, it, 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 they're not no, playing. I mean, they're actually hands. playing for a lot. No, I, I just want to win one hand. 
I mean, well, it's, it's, eight, it's eight thousand dollars difference, and it, and it, you know, it's 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 four points difference. Nice. Both of them are going to make the final. All right, just because I want to see the flop. Do you think uh, all of a sudden Tony is uh, more serious about this than Andy is? He's really thinking. I think Andy wants to win it more, but uh, that's giving the advantage to Tony because Andy's playing a bit careful. But that was a good moving by uh, by uh, Tony with a jack eye. Oh, I think Andy's putting this down. 40, Don't do it again, Tony. No. This would be a bad time to do it with a 3 7, unless you can guarantee catching an offsuit 3 7. I mean, if you do call a raise with the 3 7, I guess you're willing to make a play if you miss the flop. He's though. making at least counting chips. So this is bad for him, I'll tell you. Because if, if he raises here, Black's probably going to go all in. He's had enough of this, I'll tell you now. And he's going to go all in here. All in. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it, I mean, Dave. I mean, you can see that. That's like that's like seeing something. Uh, you know, <laughs> it's like seeing a meteor coming from about eighty-five thousand miles away. It just gets bigger and bigger. And with that, Andy Black's taking the lead back. If they, this could be it. Yeah, this could always be it. Cool. Oh, if Black raises here, Tony might go for it. Raise, 35,000 more. All in. All cool. Wow. And Tony's got the lead. He's finally got his chips in with the best wow. hand. Let's see what happens here. Big Campbell. call. Campbell. Campbell. <laughs> That's a big call. Tony, Tony's, <laughs> Tony's got him. Well, what's up on here is Andy's, Andy's you know, really he's realised that it's slipping away from oh, him, right. so he's, he's done the best thing. Again, this is good for Andy. I mean, got a call, it's not he decided to play a pot for all the chips. Yeah, yeah. This might be, this might be, a, you know, a, oh, yeah, yeah, come on. Well, he's only got a 40% shot, win. but you uh, as you it said, up? Devil, it, uh, I'll chop it. it's better than That's the way it was good. going. Right. Yeah. Yeah. There's 590 in there. It's actually Tony G all in. Yeah. But, um, well, eight, nine jacks. So he's got <laughs> the ten ball me. now. He's got the yeah. ten ball now. Oh, yeah, not ten. the queen. That's got a backdoor flush. No. Black needs the king or the ten. Mm. Yeah, king or a ten is in terrible shape. Jeez, it no, looks like Tony G. You have more. It looks like Tony G. They're arguing over who's got more. I know that. Yeah. You have more, I promise. Two blanks turn in river. Unless I'm a bad count. Anyway, we'll count it. I, I think I that... Like and, uh, you have some. No, you have more. No. How about that devil more. fish? You called it early. The 9-5 to five shot, Tony G. He's going to he's, he's gonna have 28 points. No, I don't like putting it in with King High. That's up. But did you make a move on that Ace-8-8 eight, eight board? Well, it was a great move. Did you do it? You don't want to talk to him, Tony. Just time. get on with it. For <laughs> After, uh, he's only got, got how much has he got? 10, well, it says that Andy would have been better off if uh, the share of the really snaps. I had a flush draw. Okay. I don't have a flush draw, as it turns out. I mean, this really this is over, right, Dave? I mean, right. Yeah, it's over. Good, good thing with Andy, he won't tell a lie. See, he's a poker player. They don't like to lie, you know, because if he lies, the one when they're back in their monastery gates. Because they'll be watching this the most. We're all ammo in. No you have to, to uh, say to, to, to I mean, I, I don't know about the heads no, up, Dave, but I mean, second. both these guys are, uh, are okay, playing at the top of their game, aren't they? I mean, uh, well, you know, they're both running hot. I wow. mean, yeah. they're running hot and they're playing good, and well, it's, 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 not an over. it's an odd formula to beat. I came back, I had 59,000. Tony G is just running so good, it's scary. Off and I bluffed off well, the 80. They got all the chips, and I won't even watch <laughs> it. I'm a sick bluff. If I could just control Tony my bluff. Tony G's got the best down the game, but I think Andy Black will win this. I'd like to see an ace. Nine nine seven. Okay. That's good for Tony. Keep it steady for me. Oh, go on, you lucky man, Keep Tony it steady. G. Take me to the leader, yeah. Tony G. It's all blank. Hate the board. He's getting ready to shake hands. Look, the, do you want to shake hands with him, Andy? Thanks. Well, that's a good game. Thank you. Yeah. He's done it. Yeah. Well, Tony G's come back from. Oh, yeah. And once again, I've never got a shilling on. Anyway. Yeah, that's all right. You have two wins in a second. So if you have equal points, you beat anyone too. I mean, it's going to be so close at the end. It's going to be like one point for sure.
every Premier League player has now played four matches and Tony G, the undisputed champion, with his third match victory tonight increasing his lead. He looks nailed on for the final table. Along with Andy Black, top four course, that automatic ticket in the playoff zone. A pretty good evening for Vicky Corin, taking three points and pulling her up to a comfortable playoff spot. But the bottom just got worse. Very disappointing for Marcel Lusk, just grabbing the one point and on the verge right now of relegation. Helmuth and Helpy, now they've played four and it was one, two out again. This is not good. Go, 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 Mr. G. Tony, three now you've won of these matches. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Very fortunate and just happy to, to do it. You did it a little different uh, this match. I mean, uh, usually you've been going from the offset. You actually sat back in this match and uh, waited till the heads up. Yeah, I thought strategically I had to sit back and just make sure I get a few points under my belt uh, to get through. And then eventually the opportunity came to win it and I came through and I won it. Phil Helmuth last year, he, he set the record by winning four matches out of six. And of course, his points totaled. You're kind of on pace now to either tie or break them both. I'd love to do that. I'd love to, to win four. I'd love to win five. I mean, I was trying to win all six. But unfortunately, <laughs> I can't do that. But <laughs> Well, why not? Well, why not win all six? I mean, I could do it next year, maybe. Well, the form you're in, I mean, you're definitely on target for at least four. Now, Andy, uh, uh, well done. I mean, commiserations for not winning the heads up. But, I mean, for the second time in a row, you just, you just destroyed everybody. Yeah, well, I had a lot of cards. I mean, I made one or two good moves, but mostly I just had a lot of cards. You, you may have actually knocked Yuha Helpy out of this Premier League. Uh, I mean, he was, uh, he was really thrown for a loop there, wasn't he? Yeah, well, it shows the, the value of getting off to a good start in the league. You know, you can afford to uh, play a bit more aggressively, and uh, you still know you've got other chances. So, Best of luck, guys. Next time, Helmuth and Helpy are back, and they're not mathematically eliminated, but if they don't score big, they could be stuck just trying to get into the playoffs here on the Party Poker Premier League.